what's going on bed bath and beyond investors the time is up it looks like you guys have ran out of time but hear me out hear me out all right um this might be the last video i do on bed bath and beyond so give me a give me a couple minutes uh to explain myself because this might be the last video um not just because the stock's delisted or that they went bankrupt or anything like that uh you know, really, there's nothing to talk about. The only thing that was to talk about was the PP show, right? So it looks like maybe, I don't know, something's up. It could be coming to an end. Uh, he's deleting videos. He's he's doing the Trey's Trades. If you don't know who Trey's Trades is, look him up. He was a, a big meme stock investor. So he deleted all his videos too. And it looks like PP is doing the same thing. He's deleting the Pulte videos and the the jet video that they can they kept bragging about that they were going to spacex and they never went to spacex and you know so i just wanted to make one last video and see what's 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 going to happen from here on out it's going to be interesting to see what if the grift continues uh do we continue to talk about bed bath and beyond uh even though you have a lawsuit pending it looks like there's a lawsuit coming your way and might not be the only one, so I'd watch out what you continue to say about Bed Bath & Beyond, a company that doesn't exist anymore, sold their likeness, and you continue to pump a, I guess, an idea of equity, of people getting something in return for investing in a bankrupt company. It's just insane, and you guys always ask, like, why, why do you care? Why do you care what we do with our money? Because it's hilarious. It is hilarious watching you guys squirm and come up with all these hopium ideas of what's going to happen and what kind of corporation and conglomerate is going to merge with Bed Bath & Beyond and it's going to squeeze to a million. And um, You even deleted the video that you did with interviews with Marantz and how you talked about Bed Bath & Beyond not going bankrupt. Oof, yeah, I guess maybe that's why. That doesn't really sound good on video. Oh, they're not gonna go bankrupt. There's no way. Yeah, when you've got thousands of people that watch your videos and that are in your stream giving you money, um, maybe that's why the lawsuit. I don't know. But uh, could be the end of the show. Could be or a complete turn in the show where you guys only talk about GameStop or you only talk about AMC or you only talk about something else because the Bed Bath & Beyond is gone. The grift can't continue forever, right? Or is everybody is the PP show and all of its followers going to continue to wait and continue to hope on something? No. Lawsuits are going to keep coming and you even laughed about it. You guys laughed about it in your live stream, laughing about a lawsuit, laughing about getting sued. And then after the stream, you delete videos of you and Pulte and all these other videos, huh? Something like 30,000 hours that you deleted. That's a lot of videos, man. Um, I just wanted to make a video for your followers and all the people that love you and that back you and that leave me nasty comments because uh, I talk about it. Reality of Bed Bath & Beyond no longer existing and you guys are never going to get anything, but you get the complete opposite with PP, right? Oh, something's going to happen. Don't worry. It's not going bankrupt. Equity's coming. I believe that everything's going to be all right. Yeah, it's not going to be all right. Um, and the more you talk about it, being, it's going to be all right. And the more people realize, oh, shit, I lost a bunch of money. Oh, and I lost it listening to this, this jack wagon. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm fucking pissed. I'm going to do something about it. And more people are going to do something about it. And all that super chat, you know, all the $500. Oh, don't, don't send more money because the meltdownies will get mad. Um, that's going to be your court costs right there, buddy. That's going to pay for your lawyer. Uh, so everybody that was sending in all the $500 because it was cool to piss other people off or just giving him money that he's going to use to defend himself now that he's getting sued. So it's hilarious to me that how negative you guys are. The whole community is just a cult. And if you're not with it, then they're against you. 
and they attack you and they insult you so i expect to see you guys in the comments with all your insults and how it's going to go to the moon and you're going to still get equity even though it's over and it's never going to happen but pp what's going on man what's going on you're laughing about the lawsuit like it's a joke and now you're deleting videos so what's the next move man are we still going to talk about bed bath and beyond um you know because i'll be there for it man uh i'll, I'll definitely be there for it because it's hilarious that's that's what you guys you people don't understand um you're like well i can do whatever i want with my money you're right you can um but eventually you're gonna miss that money and you're gonna want to do something about it if you can right uh just like when you lose it and it's a tax write-off but whenever you talk about it every single night and um you do live streams about it and you incorporate other people that are coming up with all these ideas of what can happen um conspiracy theories that's why alex jones got sued bro he was he was stating things that were not true and everybody knew it wasn't true and he knew it wasn't true just like you know that bed bath and beyond was a shit company and a, a very risky company and that they probably were going to go bankrupt and even when they went bankrupt i think you knew that nothing was ever going to happen you just continued the script because your whole show was based on it so yeah we've got a new trace trades and i'm here for it I'm, I'm loving this train wreck, uh, watching it from a distance, of course. Uh, maybe not. I'm sure you got one of your, one of your followers. One of, one of your followers will probably find me and dox me or do whatever that you guys do. Um, but it's hilarious for everybody else watching y'all because you guys are insane. Continuing the grift, continuing this idea that you're going to get some type of equity from a bankrupt company just doesn't happen and it's not gonna happen uh, but of course this is not financial advice this is just my opinion be careful what you invest in because it's very risky and the stock market is risky and it's probably not fair so until the next video like comment share subscribe thanks for the love